Afghan National Army or ANA soldiers paired with coalition forces are usually infantry, but just as with U.S. Army soldiers, other soldiers must be trained for combat as well. The Charlie Shadow Troop from 1st Squadron, 33rd Cavalry Regiment is partnered with a headquarters company from 4-1 Kandak Brigade at Camp Parsa in Host Province. Sergeant Pedro Rodriguez Ortiz says even though they aren't infantry, it's working out just fine. So they're coming in and learning a lot of our, our tactics, our company being infantry. So it's, for them, it's, it's, it's teaching them a lot of, uh, a lot of good uh, skills for whenever they're out and if they, when, once they do move on to running their own patrols. Shadow Troop has been working with the ANA on troop leading procedures, land navigation and vehicle maintenance. Sergeant Rodriguez Ortiz says even though there is some difficulty with the language barrier, they still want to learn. They're eager to learn. Uh, it's just a lot of the times not being able to communicate directly with them to, to do what you want them to do can, can kind of mislead them to do something else or kind of sometimes not do what you ask them to do. But um, for the most part, they, they're eager to learn. The troop soldiers of War Rakasan have been working with this company of Afghan soldiers for six months. Sergeant Rodriguez Ortiz says they are a lot closer to doing their movements on their own. Uh, yeah, there's definitely a, a, an improvement uh, from when we first got them to now. We're starting to show a little bit more uh, initiative uh, when it comes to whenever we stop and uh, they dismount, pull security, set up uh, traffic checkpoints and stuff like that. The Afghan headquarters soldiers might not be infantry soldiers, but Shadow Troop has helped train them to be just that. Reporting for Task Force Rakasan in Camp Parsa, Afghanistan, I'm Army Sergeant Victor Gardner.